Cops is filmed on location as it happens. All suspects are considered innocent until proven guilty in a court of law. Who sold your bicycle? Ask him. He knows where he lives. He was driving his truck. I know where he lives. You were driving your truck. You let a stranger drive your truck? He asked him where his bike is. I don't I, I don't know nothing. I don't know. I just got out of the hospital. I, I don't know nothing. I don't, don't know where he, if he even took his bike. Okay. Okay. So you asked him for your bike. Though. Where's my bike at? I ain't got your bike. He swung at his arm, tried to start the truck up. I punched him, took the keys out. Do you want to call charges against these men? It doesn't matter? No, I just don't want I didn't have nothing to do with it. This man says you have battered him, but he does not want to press charges. Ask so if why. I was you... Ask him why, because he's guilty. He's Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Ask me, I'm sorry. Right All right? You can talk friend. to me yes, ma yes, ma quietly. Yes, ma'am. Because I can here. Yes, ma'am. You're about two seconds away from going to jail. Now, we'll start okay. again. Start again. Now, I can I want you to talk to that man. Excuse me. Oh. Yes, ma'am. Listen to a talk. I'll do the talking. Yes, ma'am. And you're going to listen yes, for a change. Yes, ma'am. Tell me. Tell me I remember his salary. Tell me still. Yes, ma'am. Shut up. No, yeah, ma'am. I never did it. Hey. Hey, bro, we got one. Watch it, pal. Yes, ma'am. Jerry is my boyfriend. He's wonderful. We only have one day off together, and it's, it takes a lot out of the relationship. Recently, my boyfriend and I picked out an engagement ring, but I can't call him an engagement ring until he asks me to marry him. But um, I go and visit it at the jewelry store. I have visitation rights to it until it's paid for. And you say men don't what? have bad moods. Will you marry me? Okay. Are you serious? Huh? Are you serious? I'm dead serious. Yes. Will you? Will you wear my ring? Jerry. <laughs> I don't believe you. I can't believe you just did this on TV. <laughs> <laughs> How do you do this? <laughs> Wait, Jalen. I just engaged. I just got engaged. Congratulations. Thank you. 54. Okay, I need you to thank you for about 15 minutes. <sighs> Temple. You are under arrest. Okay, ma'am. Do you know what you're under arrest for? No, I'm ma'am. You're not high right now? No, ma'am. Don't you wish you were? No, I don't. I'm tired. I'm going home. Run your fingers through your hair. You got anything on your shoes? No, I don't. You want to take them off? Yeah. No problem. Charlie 105. Dump them. What are all those scads all over here? Disease, ma'am. When's the last time you hooked? What are you doing? Friday. How much do you make a week? About. I don't have to answer. What are those sores all over your legs? You were what? I was held down and burnt by a pipe. You were burned by a pipe? I was held down and burnt by a pipe. Right there? Oh, those things right there, those are warts. Those are what? No, I mean these... Yeah, I was burnt by pipes. And, and all those different places? Who did that to you? Some, uh... Have you ever thought about getting help for your crack addiction? Yeah. What would you do if I offered you some help? A program? Would you go to it? Probably not. I don't know. I can't answer that. Nobody's ever helped me. We can help you. But it's hard. I'm a miserable person. I have nobody. I do have somebody, but 
You can't go home. Why can't you go home? Are you scared when you pick up your johns? I've had pistols pointed at me. I've been raped. But you're still doing it. Why? I can't answer that because I don't know myself. Okay, I'm going to lose my hands. Watch for you, all right? Okay, come on out. I don't want you to be in tight handcuffs. Love you. We're going to put you in this car anyway. I'll get your shoes. Don't worry. Deputy Garrison, he works midnight six. He was 10.50, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> No, his wife didn't wake him up. <laughs> his wife did. did your wife wake yeah, you up? Billy, I know your wife didn't wake you up, but again, she, she woke up raw. <laughs> yeah, I guess <laughs> How many guys here, when you put a prisoner in your car, uh, check your back seat? How many guys pull the back seat out periodically to look back there? Anybody recognize these things? Well, they're mine. <laughs> huh? Found, <laughs> found in the couch over here when I took the couch apart uh, the other day. Uh, this is a rather big object to miss, okay? A lot of people handcuff people, and the man palms it like this, and then they get handcuffed, and then they get down to your car. But, I mean, this is embarrassing, you know, when you have this. I mean, it's not as embarrassing as having an Uzi in the couch. But you know, two, this, two Mac tens. I'm sorry, two Mac tens in a couch or something like that. Yeah, but you know, again, you know, watch your people. All right. Okay, listen up for the other side. Two or two Flint, two or eight Lewis, two or three Gondarella, two or one Washington. DUI arrests are unacceptable. Dang. That's all. We only yeah, have today. three. <laughs> Three DUI arrests, so yeah, my, incentive, really bang them out tonight, my incentive for you guys will be if you get me Three DUI arrests from now till the 1st of January. I'll give you a free pizza of pizza for now. <laughs> okay, gentlemen, watch it out there. Yeah, right on. You got no turkey knives sticking out of your vest. What vest? Yeah, I gotta work Christmas, New Year's. I gotta work all the holidays. Rookie on the ship. Rookie on the ship. 911, do you have an emergency? Yes, non emergency. It's okay, we'll send a deputy out to you and he'll talk to you. Come on, bro. Excuse me, did you all call the police? Why he gotta come out here to do his count? Ma'am, look, just. For all the cops last night, they shined the light on me. Well, that's good. And for they them. didn't arrest me. I want you to want to tell I want you to go in my jacket, too. I don't know nothing about your jacket. You keep acting crazy. I'm not trying nothing. We just sat it again. Big ox. Tell a tight. Come on out here. Go on. Hey. What's wrong with you? She threw that water What's on me, man. What's wrong with you, huh? She threw that water on me. What's wrong with you? What she is your problem? Put it me. down. What is your problem? She threw that water. Can't you see me? Why she threw that water on me? You stand on the just stand on the ship, Brenda. You're not sit down. I'm not going to sit on the floor. Sit phone. down. Sit down, girl. You see that, don't you? All right, Candy, don't me like that. get in the house. Right. If I have to come back here any time today, <clears throat> all right? When you speak, I can speak, right? When you speak, I can speak, right? No, you are not speaking, all right? When I can, if I have to come back here today on you, you're going when to you jail, speak, okay? When you speak, I nah, can't speak. I'm through with it. I'm through with it. Brenda, okay, he said he threw with it. Can I talk to you, Brenda. sir, because you'll be my witness. Can I, I talk mean, to Candy. you? I mean, Candy. Uh... Let me camera's my witness, right? But I don't want to. I don't want right. to go down. Well, I'm on camera. I'm on camera, right? I don't want to go down there and be arrested, okay? Because I just done five years, okay? Okay. What's happening, man? What's happening? Not really much. What's happening to you? It's clear to call down there. Yeah. Her sister says she stole a jacket out of there. They start arguing. Somebody throws water at the door. She. I'm trying to knock her out with a broom. You know, I'm still trying to be nice about the situation, okay? Because I'm not ready for this this morning. It's Thanksgiving. What's she going to do? Come here, Candy. Now, you seen that now. Come here, Candy. I ain't going to get my mom out. She's getting my jacket. Candy. I'm going to kill her. What are you doing throwing chairs out the door? Because. Hey, just take the book down, bro. Just take the book down. I don't want it. I'm going to go to my house. 
Listen, no I'm only listen, in the house. Ain't gonna be no coming out. 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 Ain't Hey, you came here? Come here, Candy. You, call, you, call, you, you got the confusion. You're going to have to handle it. You can't just leave and, and leave it like this. Am I right or wrong? Right? Okay. You see it, brother. That's all I You my wit. You're going to have to leave or somebody's going to have to leave. I ain't going to leave. Like, Brenda ain't coming in. I didn't ask you all that now. What you get mad look, at? I'm not, look, I'm tired of this. Okay, y'all okay, getting okay, on okay, my nerves. Okay, okay. All right? You're getting you on go? my nerves okay, now. Okay, you can go. Okay. No, one of y'all got to go. One of y'all got to go. It's either you uh -huh. I What do y'all got to go? All right, you got some clothes you can get out of here? Why should I have to go? Somebody got to go. Well, why do All I right? have to go? She threw the chair. I was, everything was cool, calm and collect. Why do I have to go? You see what's happening, man? Why do I have to go? She, it was calm and cool. And I was walking in the house about my own business. She threw the chair up, so. Come on. Put your hand up. <laughs> You don't throw chairs at folk like that. Oh, you know, now, see, problem. I got the wrong person in jail right now. No, I ain't got the wrong person in jail, but there's somebody else I need to take, too. Who what? You. Who what? Because, see, if I had seen you throw that chair out this door, you'd have been going to jail, too. She came in. Candy, I don't want to hear it. You had no right to be throwing nothing Girl, get at her. Down. She threw something at me. You had no right to do that. All right. That's wrong. Okay. You don't see nothing wrong with that? I am. Okay. Answer me. What's going yeah. on? The next time I come here, it's going to be her that's going to go. Because I'm going to look at you. Okay. Okay? As a troublemaker. All right? All right. But throwing that chair out that door. So the next time I come here, okay, I'm going to have him look at you and not look at her. All right? Because you're the one that's going to be going down next time. All right? I just want to let you know. Keep it in mind. Delta 700, Delta 200. All right. We're going to be in your district for the next couple hours, task force. Put your hands on your head. Yeah, put your hands on the hood. Get on the set. Stuck it underneath. Yeah. One moment in the tunnel. Yeah, that. Yeah, this too. Okay, put your hands on your head. Open your mouth. Lift up your tongue. How you doing? Put your hand back down there. That ain't nothing? Well, why you got nothing in your pocket? What is this? What is this nothing? That's all you got is nothing. So that's something though, Anna. You never been in He had the rocks in his hand the whole time. He never opened his hand. I grabbed him and then they were in his hand. He's working for that guy. Yeah. Yeah. Come here. What are you doing, working for that other guy? I, I don't work for them guys. Well, how come everybody got cocaine but you and you got all the money? But you I, tell I, me. I don't work for them guys, Look at my hand, man. That's a, I, I live up black every day, man, you know. See them, man. A man that sell dope, man. He can't clean like that, man. I don't doubt you work hard. It's just your work is illegal. Put your hands behind your back. Underneath the pants it came out of. No. That was it was under her, her pants. Put it, put me in with this. You saw what fell from her yeah. pants? Right. Don't feel bad. If I put them in my pants, it would fall through too. I ain't got much to hold this up. <laughs> it's okay. The game's over. That's all. It's over. That's all. all right, let's go. Delta 200, 1091. How much you want to bet there's not cocaine in that bag? I see. Ain't no cocaine in that bag. How much you want to bet? How about your freedom? No That's a bet. Woo! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Get on the ground! All right, all right, put your hands on your head. He still got his dough. <laughs> you fool! He goes, I ain't running. I said, breathe. 
Let's hey, man. Hey, man. Hey, you told door. me you stopped dealing drugs, remember? He did, about five minutes ago. <laughs> okay, partner, you all right? Yes, all right. What's up? Okay, bad guys, listen up. First of all, is anybody here innocent? I didn't think so. <laughs> all right, we'll get you in just a minute. All right, don't move. You understand? Yeah. You got a leash for the dog? No. Somebody got the dog covered? I got the dog covered if he comes to the front. All right, pal, I'm going to tell you what we're going to do, all right? Keep your hands on your head. Step out. You got handcuffs on? Straight on down to the ground now. Hey, there's a leash in there. Uh, Where's he got it? He was standing right here. He was standing right here. Oh. Is that where you went and got it? Okay, very good. You got the evidence back? You wish to discuss the incident with us, pal, without a lawyer? No, I just said. Very good. You're under arrest for trafficking in cocaine. That carries a three-year mandatory sentence, OK? Appreciate you doing business with us. Really do. All right, don't ask him any more questions. No. All right, everybody know the Bostick House? We hit it about two months ago. Same place. You got it. Same big guy selling dope again. OK, the guy usually doesn't give us trouble, but he does try to get rid of the evidence. Get the guy. There's a bed there. Get him right down on that bed. Watch his hands. We took four guns out of this place last time. If he goes reaching, stop him. Go in, Frank. Go, 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 go. Police! I don't think the general public has any idea how, how bad the crack cocaine problem is. Jay, I think we got Bostick out in the field. Let's get some cuffs on him. How you doing, Tim? How you doing tonight? Well, I don't blame you. I told you we'd be back. Who is selling the cocaine out of here? I would live here. You know, I know what's going on. It's nothing I can do because I have no other place to go. Okay. You know, I only stay here because of my kid. My sister just came and picked him up a while ago. Does your mother know what's going on? My mom? Of course she does. Is she selling it? Yeah, a little. Okay, does your mother have any in the house now? No, I'm being honest. I wouldn't lie to you. Sometimes. Will she be bringing any home with her tonight? No, she's in medical school. She goes to medical school? Yeah. And she sells crack? I can't tell my mama nothing. Not a thing. Well, maybe you ought to think about living somewhere else. Where is that for me to go? Do you have a job? Yeah, I'm working, but I just, it's not enough right now. I'm saving up, you know. So you're kind of trapped here? Yeah. See, I just lost my car two weeks ago, okay? So how is that for me to get back and forth? Well, I sympathize with you, and I feel sorry for you. But when we have to come over and the little baby's dying because he ate crack rocks found on the floor, that's not, that's not going to be very nice. That's true. Here. Would you do me a favor? Yeah. Would you show me where your mother usually does keep her cocaine when she has it? <sighs> Would you mind doing that for me? She usually keeps it in a bathroom, in the medicine cabinet. The back bathroom? Yeah, in her room. What's she keeping here? Huh? What does she keep in here? In the containers. You know what you found before? Crack? Yeah. OK. Oh, really? The saddest part that I've seen is the children. Hey, Gonzo. And the children are definitely the victims of this drug. We're taking two people to jail tonight for having cocaine at this house again. Now, this is the second time. OK? Now, I'm really concerned about the kid. And if all you can do is leave him with your mother, when you know your mother's selling crack, we can't have that. You know, we don't get along. And I told her, if the people come in here, they're going to take him. You know, I, I love why. my baby too much. And I know how he heals the strangers out here in the streets. So how is he going to be to somebody else in another home, somebody taking care of him? Well, I got a feeling this is going to wake you up, and you're just going to be fine with your baby. OK? I don't want you to disappoint me now. I won't. All right, go on in the house and sit down.